Hey everybody, it's Matt Shu from Upright Health and I'm back from my vacation. And uh, while I was on vacation, my partner, um, the, my partner on the FAI Fix project, uh, Shane Dowd, got some terrible, 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 terrible news. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Shane is extremely mobile. I refer to him often as the mobility monk. Uh, when I first met him, he did have some hip mobility issues that were obvious, like he couldn't do this. He couldn't fully get that knee down. He was kind of stuck here. Um, he, had, he had a bunch of right hip issues that resulted in a lot of back, pretty debilitating back pain. Um, and he was told at, at, at uh, some point that he had very likely FAI. So uh, while I was on vacation, Shane was doing some investigation. Um, he went to a doctor to get his hip checked out. Uh, he wanted to see what would happen if he got the x-ray and the MRI on his fully functioning, fully healthy hip. And so he uh, did a video that I'm going to link for you to go check out where he explains uh, what happened when he went to see the doctor, what the x-ray said, what the MRI said. It's a fantastic video. You really need to watch it. So I am providing the link. Please go watch it. The summary, I'm going to spoil it a little bit for you, uh, is that he definitely has FAI bone shapes. So he has the morphology, meaning the, the shape of his hip, of, hip, of the bones of his hip joint um, in an x-ray are bad, right? They're bad. They are, he's got the bad FAI uh, impingement shapes. He's got the hip impingement shapes. And in a follow-up, he went and got an MRI to see whether or not he has a labral tear, which is the other super scary thing that um, gets thrown around and that needs to be repaired and, and sutured and whatever. Sorry, not sutured, but well, sometimes, but or cut and debrided, whatever. Um, which is a topic that actually we're gonna look at in another video coming up soon. But in any case, you need to go check out this video that Shane did. He talks about his FAI diagnosis, the MRI results, and uh, talks about how he views all that, knowing that after years of work, he's actually fine, right? He started off really bad. He didn't get the x-ray, he didn't get the MRI, he just kept working with the muscles to build all his mobility back to become really more mobile, flexible, and stronger than I would say 98% of the population, if not 99% of the population. Um, his hips fully functional, but the x-ray and the, and the MRI kind of show something different. So check out his video, go see what he has to say, and remember that pain sucks. Life shouldn't.